ether and air and its leading quality we have discussed one quality that is nothing but dryness and the second quality we started the lightness and we also mentioned when dryness is there as a result roughness also will come this also we have to understand whenever he we hear about vata we should always remember in the mind it is the ether and air then many things many qualities of vata we can easily remember once you push your mind towards ether and air <coughs> When you read the Nadi, the pulses, first you will get the Vada beating. So according to the Nadi science, Vada should beat one, Pitta should beat Vada's half and Kappa should beat Pitta's half. So we will say Vada is the king. If the Vada is there, movement will be there. If the Vada is not there, movement will cancel. If the Vada imbalance has come, your movements will be uh, lost. And uh, blood circulation, different things you will see, but the movement will be restricted. In some people, you can see there is some Vada disorder come. They will not be able to move. the area underneath their wrist uh, waist he they may look uh, clinically okay but some vada imbalance come they won't be able to move because the motor nerve from the central nervous system the command of the central nervous system will travel to the muscle through the motor nerve and if the motor nerve is unable to transfer this neurotransmission to the connected muscle there is a place called muscle belly or neuromuscular junction and if it doesn't reach there the muscle can't work mata no nyaku kaze o mite mite to no ichiban ue no tokoro ni aru kedo バータピッタの脈はバータの半分ですカッパの脈はピッタの半分ですなんでバータの脈は脈の筋群王様っていうふうに言われてて動きを一番取っているのがバータです動きっていうのはバータが作ってるので例えば中枢神経の運動神経のバーターの伝達によって動いているので脳の神経からこの筋肉を動かすために途中で詰まりがあったりするとその信号が届かないで筋肉が動かなくなってしまうということもあります So we have to understand that Vada will beat when you come to the Nadi one. That means the highest factor is Vada. If Vada is the leader, if Vada is there, Pitta and Kapha can do something. If Vada is not there, the neurotransmission won't work. Your heart may not work, your lung may not work. So if Vada is not there, that means you are on the death way. Whether Pitta is there, Kapha is there, a different thing. Unless the Vada is there, the driving force is there, unless the leader is not there, it is not going to give a good result. Like if the one is there in the front, you can put zero and zero and zero and zero, it has value. If the one is not there, you add Pitta, you add Kapha as a zero, 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 zero. Absence of one, absence of Vada doesn't make any value, any sense. If Vada is absent, that means your movement is restricted, you are going to die. Vata is 1, that's what you say. Kappa is 2, 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 that's what you say.
てもピッタとかがいっぱいあったとしても1であるバータが1個もなければ死んでるのと同じです。Uh, somebody comes to you with some pain. Say, I have pain here, I have pain here. So you are looking to them. We have basically three modes of diagnosing Ayurveda that is, the first part of diagnosing. Then we have Ashtasthana Parishna, eight places, eight parts, which we check from Nadi, Mutra, Mala, like that it goes. And when somebody comes, With a pain, we have to first see that in Sanskrit called darshana. How is that person? We are looking. Just、uh, coming, your camera is clicking. How is this person? Is he a fat person? Is he moving slowly? If somebody is moving slowly, that means he is suffering from b a d h a disorder. A p i t t a person is. They, walk, they are not walking, they are running. They think they are walking, they are running. A kapha person will go、uh, like an elephant is moving, they are going like they, they, will, they, they are like a ch- dancing people. They are not in rush, they will go in an in a elephant's like moving, we call a n a n a d a in Sanskrit, the elephant's walking. If a woman walk, a beautiful woman walk like an elephant, so she moves like this. So, like that, the kapha person is not in a hurry, he is not in a worry. So he takes time now, okay, okay, like that. They are ready to go with the time. So they move like that. So when somebody comes, you have to, your camera has to look how the patient c o m e c o m e very fast,、mm-hmm. speak very fast, act very fast, or they are very easily reacting rather than responding, or they are moving like slowly. So the first we have to see, the first diagnosing is darshana. In which your camera is post. This is the first clue as a doctor we get he, <laughs> which category he belongs. その部位というよりもその人が細いのか太いのか話し方はどうなのか動き方はどうなのかまず見ることピッバータの人は慌てて歩くけどピッターの人はバシャッもうなんか走ってる本人は普通かもだけど、まあ、もう走ってるのと同僚ぐらいの速さでカパンの人は急ぐってことは全然なくて。ゾウのことを言ったんだけどゾウみたいにのんびりのんびりなんか急ぐことなく歩くしなんか綺麗な女性はゾウみたいに歩くゾウみたいに優雅に歩くっていうふうに言われていてなんであとバータの人はリア,クティリアクティングするリスポンドしないでリアクトするっていうふうに言っててリアクトっていうのは反応したらわキャッパーみたいな。<笑>レスポンドは状況を見て必要だからそれやりますっていう感じなんですね。So, this is the first part of the way we are seeing the darshana part. And in the darshana part, sometimes you will see if I open, my teeth are little black. So, we have to see whether the patient is smile, how is the teeth. If you see black color, it is, that is showing the vata. So, if somebody is coming with some reddish color, little bit, you will have to see it is pitta. And when there is somebody, when they love you, look the tongue. Accidentally, if you can see, k a b h a person will be white like that in the darshana part. You have to see many things. So, this is the first observation of the Ayurvedic doctor. We, then we come, then we put. He has this much vada, this much pitta, this much k a b h a We are putting a knot. So, In the final, we will add and we find that more is to Vata. This is the we have to come later because to find out somebody's constitution, whether he is Vata and Pitta and Kapha, it is not an easy business as we think. There are many things you have to go through, some details. There are exceptional people, we can say they are typical Vata, typical Pitta, typical Kapha. But when you see something which is 
opposite characters. For example, somebody is coming to you. He is, according to the principles of Ayurveda, he is Kapha and Pitta. Kapha person, when you touch a Kapha person, you will feel coldness. The body is cold because Kapha means according to Ayurveda, it is water. So if you touch a Kapha person's body, he, he will be cold. And due to some extreme cold, it will be a little bit sticky also. When you touch the body of a Vada person, there also you will find cold. But when you compare the touch of Kapha and Vada, Kapha person touching, you will feel a slight stickiness due to Kapha because Kapha, the mucus, has a sticky nature. So, the Vada people won't have that stickiness, so it will be simply called when it is Kapha, it is a slight stickiness will be there. So, a person is coming to you, he is a composition of Pitta and Kapha. He has some coffee. Normally, coughing is connected with the kapha and any kapha dosha, the first remedy is heat. If you give heat, you can で、いろんなところで観察をしてくださいで、えっと、あの、so in kapha, we have to understand kapha means water. Water means coolness, coldness. So a kapha person has a, some coughing or body pain. What we will do an oil which has kapha pro, anti-kapha properties. That means this oil should make heat in his body. Mustard seed oil is a good base. Neem oil is also good. When you add some heat drevia, some, some medicines which has heating property like dry ginger, clove, camphor, menthol, thymol, these are all heating property if you add with the, any so-called oil or with any oil, like for an example, if you use coconut oil, you add these particles like camphor, dry ginger, pepper, long pepper this is all with the heating property if you add that this will become a heat property oil if you apply it to a kabha person this will induce heat and the moment heat goes to a kabha body it he will get relief <laughs> ま、<笑> 
みたいなその熱を与えるスパイス薬草と一緒にしてカパを取り除く方法をしますはい。Instead of heating directly, you make an indirect heating like you are keeping it in a bowl and that bowl you keep it in hot water. This is called Patra Paga in Sanskrit, means making the oil to your body temperature or a little higher. So, when you do this on a Pitta person, it is not advised to do the heating. But when you do it on a Vata and Kapha person, you should do this. You should not simply take the oil and start to apply. You should do the Patra Bhaga technique, then on the Kapha person it will be more effective. In the Vada also it is effective. でその体温か体温がちょっと高めまで汚染する方法がパットラパーカーですけどそれをやるのはカパの症状に温めたものをアプライするのはカパの症状なんですけどぴったりはやらないです。It was our traveler driver. I tried to call him two, three times, but he was not picking up, but he was、mm-hmm. coming to home late after a trip. Okay.